Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Why my voice sounds so deep? Anyway, welcome back to my channel. My name is Phoebe. If you are new here, thank you so much for joining us. If you've been here, thank you so much for sticking around. Thank you for telling your friends to tell their friends to tell their mama's friends to come check me out. Today I'm doing a review. And y'all already, if you guessed, I am reviewing the new Fenty Ease Drop Skin Blurring Tint. Okay, summertime is like right around the corner and this drop came right on time. I'm not a fan of wearing foundation in the summertime. It's too heavy, it gets too hot. I just can't do it. I'm usually wearing powders in the summertime. So my goal is to see if this is going to be my go-to summer product. Anyway, let's get straight to this review. I'm excited and I hope you guys are excited. All right, I'm going to prime my skin because I'm always going to prime my skin. I have like oily skin, so I know for a fact that I will need a little primer. I'm using my favorite primer, the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. All right. So for the easy drop, um, I'm just going to give you guys some information. It gives you a light to medium coverage. It's for all skin tones. It blends and bursts to instant... Okay. It blends and blurs to instant perfection. It's light as air. Um, I'm excited. I think that's all the information that they give you. But yeah, this retails for like $29.50. It's a little bit expensive. Um, <laughs> but I think it's a good product. It comes in this little handy dandy um, container. It is... 1.8 fluid ounces it says shake well so make sure you shake well because i am wearing white i'm gonna put on a bib just to protect because i'm clumsy i know myself you gotta know yourself anyway let's get started i'm gonna do one side of my face and then we're going to just review that side um so i looked up the product and it says it's blessed is best to apply it with your fingers so here we go as far as my color <laughs> I don't really have a Fenty product to match it to, so I kind of guessed. And I think I guessed a little wrong because it's a little red. Just a little bit. Um, this kind of happened when I got the Fenty powder foundation. The Yeah, this is the same thing that happened to me. But so far, it's going down well. I'm going to put some on my eyelids. All right, my camera was a little too bright, so I had to like take it down. I was like, what is that? But anyway, this is the right side of my face with the tint on. You gotta get it behind the wig, you know? All right. So this is it, and it looks like skin. This looks like freaking skin, and I'm loving it. Like what? So this is the side without, and this is the side with, and I am glowing. What? Oh, honey. Do y'all can't, okay. I know my skin is normally like really glowy when I come on to do my videos, but this is glowing before like anything. All I did was put on primer. I am really loving this. All right, I'm going to get to the other side of my face. So it does look a little red while I'm applying it. But most of my foundations always look like that. And I never really fall on like one exact color. I always have to either just get the reddish color or I have to go a little darker and I don't like that. I really like this. Like this is something I would even wear with my mask because it just feels like lotion. Like it looks like you're put it feels like you're putting on moisturizer. I don't know what is going on with my camera. It's just too bright. It won't focus. We just keep moving. Okay. We move. You guys. Okay, I'm gonna do 
Um, in the summertime, I still conceal. I still like like a concealer look. I still want to look like glamorous, you know. So I'm going to do a little bit of that with this look. But this, what? Okay, my lips are a little dry. Put on some lip gloss. Y'all see how I'm holding it? I don't want to get... <laughs> oh my gosh, but this looks so good. Like, okay, camera, help me out. My skin is glowing. I can't really say how much you're supposed to use. Um, What I did, I just put like three drops on each finger because I'm using three of my fingers and that's what I applied. One thing I will say is you may have to go back and apply to some areas just to get the coverage that you want. That's why it says light to medium. But this is amazing. Like, I think what I'm loving most right now is the fact that it just feels like skin. It doesn't feel like I have anything on my face. With foundation, it doesn't feel cakey but you know you have it on your face. This just feels like I put on my moisturizer and I'm going out like this is it gotta make sure my bib is on but yes okay so let me do the rest of my face because I'm excited <laughs> this is amazing okay Fenty thank you all right because this is like more of a natural look I'm gonna go in for a darker concealer I'm not really gonna talk you guys through this step but I just wanted to let you know that I'm using a darker concealer Rather than something um, two shades lighter, I'm just going to go in with like my chestnut. This is what I normally use to conceal my brows and the top of my lip. But today, I'm using this because I don't want to take away from this natural look. This is really just freaking amazing. I kept it as natural as possible. I don't know what's going on with my voice. Please ignore that. But I kept it as natural as possible. I just put a matte eyeshadow on. I'm not wearing any falsies. Um, as you can see, I did put on like concealer. I put on bronzer. I put on highlight. And it looks like skin. This is... Okay, y'all know I get dumb excited when I like something, so I am dumb excited. Um, this is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. I'm trying to get this wig together, y'all. 
Alright you guys, so I kept everything natural. I put on some NYX Butter Gloss. I combined it with the Fenty Cream Gloss. And this is what I got. I put on a bit of brown shimmer on my eyelids. You can't really see it because I wanted to keep everything natural. For mascara, I used the Maybelline Sky High. Um, all in all, this is an amazing product. That's literally all I have to say. It's an amazing product. I love the compact size. This is something you can easily throw in your purse and go about your business. If you know you have to go somewhere after work or after the gym, throw this in your bag. And it just makes you look pulled together without making you look cakey. You don't really have to set it unless you want to. I did set it with the Milani setting spray. And that's just because I'm oily. So I wanted to see what it would look like after I set it. And this is what it looks like. I'm still glowing. Um, I put on some blush and I put on some highlighter and I put it only right here. Everywhere else is literally the product. I'm glowing primarily because of the product. I did not put on powder anywhere else except under my eyes and over my lips and anywhere else that I may have applied highlight, um, applied concealer, but it's an amazing product. It is worth every single penny. It's $29.50 at Sephora and it is worth it. I think what I may do is go back to Sephora and get a, um, a cooler color because this was a bit too red for me. And I know I get darker in the summertime so I want to be sure that I have a color that I can easily transition into summer and this is a bit too red for me. So I'm going to go back and pick up another color. Um, she allows you to match your shades to the um to her other products like the foundation. I don't have her foundation so I didn't have a shade to match to. This was like me guessing. And it was a pretty close guess. I'm going to go back and get a cooler shade and just go from there. But this is going to be a staple in my summer bag because it's amazing. Like this is perfect for like going out with friends, going on a date. God. Send some men my way, please. So I can go on a date this summer. Um, going on a date. I don't know, going to a barbecue? I don't know, just, like, this is something you can wear outdoors and I feel like your skin is going to melt off. You know what You know what I mean when I say melt off. In the summertime, yes, you look cute, but once that sun hit, you ain't cute no more. You're hot. You're hot. Okay? And blotting is not going to save that face, honey. You got to go sit inside where there's air conditioning. This, you ain't got to do that. You can stay outside, okay? Because this feels like moisturizer. It is moisturizer. It feels like skin. Go get it. The medium, the light to medium coverage is very true. It covered what it had to, but it allowed my skin to still look like skin. It's like, um, but no, seriously, go get this product. I promise you won't regret it. And if you do, I don't know. You got to talk to Fenty, not me, because I enjoyed it. If you don't, I don't know what to tell you. We know Fenty is a little bit pricey, so save your dollars. I don't know. Do something. So your man will get it for you. But anyway, get it. It's a great product. Okay, I love it. You gonna love it. She made all the shades. All the shades. She's known for that, so I wasn't really surprised. But you can't tell me that you not you don't have a shade. I guessed and I got the right shade. Like, come on now. Um, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. I will see you all in the next video. Stay safe. Get vaccinated. Please, so we can get out of this panoramic. If you have not subscribed already, please hit that subscribe button. Turn on your bell notifications because around here you want to stay on top of every drop. Tell your friends and tell their friends and tell their mama's friends to come check me out. I will see you all in the next video. Again, stay safe. Okay?